Here after switching owners, the Holly Hill Mall is home to new food favorites. Grace Sweeney joins us live in Burlington via Skype with more on the mall's transition. Grace? Eight months ago, Burlington Square Mall was losing a lot of their shoppers to the competitors like Alamance Crossing. Now with a new owner, Holly Hill Mall is bringing in some new shoppers with some new stores. Last year, the lots were empty. Now the mall is booming. On a Sunday afternoon, the parking lot is packed at Holly Hill Mall in Burlington. David Morton bought the mall last year and is working to bring in new business. We have actually leased in the last seven months, we've leased about 13 spaces. Morton says he only wants family-oriented tenants at the mall, but new additions like La Cocina and Yozone have brought in Elon students as well. La Cocina Mexican restaurant that has over a thousand people a day coming into it. Elon students can't get enough of the self-serve yogurt shop Yozone. I go probably like once a week at least. And now Yozone wants to bring in more students inside their doors. We're getting set up to take Phoenix Cash any day now. Um, we start doing some more advertising towards Elon. Morton says more shops for Elon students will move in. Back, we're working with a uh, ladies clothing store right now. That a uh, big reason that they're coming in the mall is because of the Elon ladies. But it's not just all about the ladies. Holly Hill Mall has sports stores and video game stores to attract all clientele. And Morton says that he wants to have tenants that are very family oriented. And the good news about that is that he wants good value, which equals students can spend less money and also get a great experience when it comes to shopping and eating around here. Jasmine, 